Hey beginners, this is for a tisket, a tasket, number 138, Essential Elements, book one, page 34, okay? So we've worked a lot on um, in the key of C major, and we started a lot on G string, but now we're actually going to start on D string, okay? And we're still going to play in the key of C major. So we're starting on a pickup. Remember, the pickup is the very last beat of the very last measure, okay? So if you look at that second ending, you're going to see a dotted half note, which is three full beats a slow bow like we thought of when we played French folk song and then that last beat is actually the G prior to the first full measure so it'll sound like this you count one two three and beat forward be that G one two three and then you have another G right after that so you have one two three G, G. then you have an E an F natural low two close to one, right? And those E to F are slurs on an up bow. Notice how they're the same in the same bow. Okay, then I go back to a G. Then an E F slur again. G. Your choice to either use four or open A. Yeah, so stretch. Then G. the half note G in the beginning, okay? So this is where you see the repeat sign in the beginning. You're gonna start from the half note G, okay? We don't play the pickup again. So you have G, E, F. Make sure your F's a low two. Stretch. Low two. So that would be a tisket a tasket. Again, you might want to air bow a little bit to make sure that you know what string you're going to play on and when, as well as to practice those slurs, okay? Um, again, if you also need to write in reminders of what's low too, you can do that as well. Let's look at 139, which is Russian folk tune, okay? And you can read the little bit of history that comes before it, but we're going to start on three fingers on G string, which is C, right? So you have C, open D, Low 2F natural, then G, then you're going to a low 2 on A string, C natural. Okay, if you notice I'm not picking my fingers up to put them down, I'm trying to keep them as close as possible. It's like very sneaky, right? Then I go back to open A, D, low 2 C, A, then G, E, low 2, stretch for 4. So just be careful. That one's not super tricky, but you do want to make sure that when you're jumping from G to C that you're going to a low two, okay? And also here when you're going from three to three, just try to slightly move your fingers over. You don't have to pick them up and drop them down, okay? You don't want to waste um, any energy that you don't need to, okay? So again, air bow is always a good way to do this singing the notes out loud if you have to, right, while you air bow, just so you can map it out in your mind where you're going before you start to play, okay? If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, good luck.